who worked off our knife thrust in the past, there's a billion places you can go, you always know that. We're going to go off of the energy that's coming at us and really working with that energy as far as the continuation of it. Now, let me see a knife here real quick. This is, you're not going to get anything. This thing happening here, right? So you get this real quick little jab, okay? Then you're not going to get this action. This is for somebody trying to stick the knife through your belly into your spine. This is somebody thrusting in, trying to thrust this right through you, okay? A quick jab, you can pretty much forget it. We've played with that for years and years and years and years, played with that. I mean, really what it comes down to is that that's a weapon, that's an edge, right? Just think of somebody throwing a jab, constantly throwing a jab, but it's got, you know, six inches of edge out, out on the end of it. Now, parry that. Not really a great scenario, exactly. You gotta get out of the way and find yourself a better weapon, okay? You don't want to go against that. I mean, you, you really have to work your distancing. Hence, ball and chain exercise, really valuable for that. Work on your conditioning, work on your cardio, work on your speed, get out of the way. All right, all that being said, we're looking at this as being a thrust that somebody's trying to stick this through your belly, right through your spine, okay? So it comes in, it just comes in here, whoa! Continue that on, right? And take it down with that, okay? And all I want you to do, back up with front move that out of frame there. Okay. So let's go this way just a little bit. See what you see, we stand frame, that force, right? Because what we're looking at, Again, is moving here and following that, all right? And you can go a million different places with this. It depends on the energy they have, all right? So, one thing say. And so, when thrust happens, we're catching that here, right? Call that catch that here and trying to continue their energy through. I'm not trying to pull my partner, okay? In fact, if they end up being real stable and actually already going back, then I need to follow that energy. Please again. So, I'm following that energy. That makes sense. I'm continuing that energy through. So that's part of the practice we have going on here. If I do this, I go here and they pull back before I fall that energy. I'm not able to fall that energy. Then that's going to take them into these things, right? Thank you. Okay. <laughs> I meant that. All right. So everybody's clear on this. It's going to change. The energy it's going to change with each different person you work with. When they thrust in. You're trying to here continue the energy through. I don't want to let go of it. I'm showing you continue the energy through, right? I want to hold on to that and don't want to let go of it. Whoa! Here, man. Thank you. I want to see what I can get. Okay. Now, what did I take it to? What was it this on? Number two. Number two. Okay.